My friends, welcome to a new and exciting episode of The Dean's List, where I talk about what I want, because I'm the man. It's a good day, my friends. It's Monday. God made it. We're out here. So if you've been keeping up, I survived the fast, my friends. I only made it uh, till Friday night. So really only like two days. I would say it was Wednesday and Thursday because I ate Friday night and I didn't eat. Or the last thing I ate was Tuesday at lunchtime. I had some tuna salad. So so that was cool. It would have been better had I made it till Saturday, but it is what it is. I'm still here, which goes to show like a couple days without food, you'd be all right because I was all right. We all all right. Right? Right. So that's very cool. Oh, I just saw a Tesla on the road, right? Now we know Teslas are gay. That's okay. Um, everybody has a right to exist. But it's so funny because I'm watching this Tesla and I had this thought. I thought I've never seen a Tesla with the windows down, right? And I wonder if that's because they're so ashamed of the car they bought, you know, that they're driving a power drill down the road, this hyped up Prius, that they just can't stand themselves and they don't want to show their face to the public. You know, we're gas for life, baby. <laughs> we're gas for life. Shout out Harrow. You know what I mean? The mechanic of mechanics. Um, we're gas for life, dude. I got a, I got an electric weed whacker, but I'm not going to try to drive it down the street. What are you doing, man? What are you doing? I mean, I get some of the little stuff like a scooter or something. But um, a car is stupid. It's stupid. So, you know what I mean? Come on now. Everybody knows, like, the grid can't support it. Uh, they can't even support when all the people use their air conditioning, right? I mean, California, y'all got brownouts, dude. We don't even claim y'all as a state to the rest of the world. We don't claim California as a state. It's its own entity. We don't know what they are. You know, <laughs> We don't know what they are. <laughs> they got, like, eight-lane highways, and they want to tell us about pollution. What? What? Please, California. Oh, check this out, my friends. I don't know if you got an Aldi near you, but I tried this stuff recently. This is honey salted almond milk chocolate. My friends, Aldi, this is crack, dude. This is crack. I don't know where Aldi came up with this stuff, but holy moly, dude. I tried it last week. I had to go back and get two more because they don't even sell it at the Aldi by me. I guess they, they only keep it for the rich white people up on 73 in Marlton. You know what I mean? Whatever. I'm out here. So I got some. also found some hot honey Gouda cheese. That sounds kind of cool, right? I What? Hot honey Gouda, dude. So I'm going to have to try this. I did get some sauerkraut too somewhere. Oh, yeah, right here. Check this out. I love red sauerkraut, my friends. I love red sauerkraut. This stuff's so good. I just eat like half a jar of this stuff. Another thing that's good for you, right? And because this is from Germany or Bavaria, no, Germany, um, it doesn't have anything crazy in it. It's just red cabbage, sugar, spirit vinegar, water, apple pieces, table salt, natural apple flavor, natural spice flavor. No monocytium glutamate, no potassium sorbate, no thiacin, niacin, riamine. You know, why can't America, I'm, I'm not knocking America, we got a lot of good things, but why can't we make red cabbage like this? Why, why I gotta get this from Germany? Come on, America, come on. We can do better, right? We can do better, so let us do better. And then I will support it, I will support it. I would love to only buy American products that were great, that I could say were great, that I could stand by and be like, yeah, man, it's from America, dude. This is the best. And we make some things that are good, you know. Um, I wish I could think of one. But I know we make some things that are good. We're not England. You know what I mean? We're not England. We, I mean, you know what I mean? You, you, you know what I'm saying. So, um, yeah. Actually, I'm about to crack this cheese. I have no plate, but I'm a little hungry. So I was like, do I get instant noodles for lunch? But you know how I talk bad about Doritos. So then I couldn't eat instant noodles for lunch because that's basically like Doritos in noodle form, man. You know, and I'm not down with that. Crackers smell good. 
you know i don't know i don't even know how i'm gonna cut this cheese i don't have a plate i'll have to cut it on the chocolate bar that's a little crazy but it's okay it's okay the dean's list don't find problems we find solutions so now you can find out how this hot honey gouda tastes let's just cut a slice off this eh all right whatever we're not gonna be so fancy today i don't even know exactly what gouda is what type of cheese where it comes from what country it originates i don't know i don't know much about gouda i'm not a huge gouda fan but this sounded good because it was flavored piss me la mm. Not much honey. It doesn't taste very sweet to me. Mm. This is probably a not buy again for me. I mean, whatever. It's cheese. I eat it. But this is definitely a... This won't be a repeat buy. It's not hot enough, and it's not honey enough. I always felt like good is mild. And this is really living up to it. Gouda. It's like the vanilla of all things, right? It's like American cheese. I could live without it, dude. Hit me with some Swiss, man. Hit me with some Swiss. I like that. Even some baby Swiss, right? You know? I wonder if they use baby bacteria for that. Or if it's less fermented. That's why the holes are smaller. I don't know. Who could say? Who could say? I'm sure some internet cheese expert will tell me. Hopefully they found their way from Facebook over to my page, right? That's where most like the grammar police and like, you know, single moms are correcting everyone, right? <clears throat> yeah, it's definitely an underwhelming cheese. I'm not knocking my socks off, but do look out for this stuff, my friends. The one nice thing about Aldi, they're not charging you like $17 for cheese. That's one of the reasons I don't buy so much cheese at ShopRite. I can't be paying like 11 bucks for a little block of cheese. Blah, 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 inflation, but you're hurting me, man. Come on. So that's all right. Maybe I'll eat a little when I go back in. No biggie. All good. Whew. I would thought we'd shoot a vid for the people because we're out here, man. We're out here, okay? Dean's List. We're pushing forward. It's a movement, my friends. It's a positivity movement. We're not afraid. Not afraid to say what's right. Not afraid to say it's okay to believe in God. Not afraid to say whatever I feel like saying. So, anyway. It's a good Monday, my friends. Sun is shining on us. God made it, and we're out here. All right? So, you guys stay up. Stay cool. And to the next one, my friends. Peace.